worse. Absolutely yeah. lucky. We had power and we had heat and we had some food. Laura Acevedo, ABC 10 News. Mm. Thank you, Laurel. When the ABC 10 News meteorologist Angelica Campos has been tracking just how much snow San Bernardino County has gotten. And Angelica, all of that snow can have residual effects. That's right, Wale. We could be looking at snow melt leading to flooding. So if we put things in perspective here, how much snow did Lake Arrowhead had? Of course, you saw the images with snowpack all the way covering a lot of the windows, 110 inches. The ratio typically when we talk about snow is 10 to 1, 10 inches to 1 inch of water. So how much water is going to be coming out of all that snowpack? Anywhere from 9 to 12 inches. So that's going to lead to flooding. Plus we have an atmospheric river and not just one. There could be multiple ones all the way through the middle of March and warmer air later in the week is going to begin that snow melt process. We're also going to be looking rain to rain here in our area. I'll give you a closer look at what we can expect here in San Diego in our seven day forecast. Wally. Thank, Thank you. you.